What's going on guys, it's Westrom here, back with another video, and in today's vid, we're going to be playing some of the best shooter games on Core Games. Now some of you may be asking, what is Core? Well let me tell you. Core is an online platform powered by Unreal Engine which allows you to play or create PC games for free. There's all kinds of RPGs, shooter games, simulators, and more. This makes it an all-in-one platform whether you be making games, playing games, or even just trying to make content. What makes Core super special though is they are exclusively launching on the Epic Games Store. They're releasing an early access today, April 15th. So if you guys are watching this video, go down below in the description and download it right now. And if you download it using your Epic Games account, you can get Epic exclusive character cosmetics shown on the screen now. Last but not least, they're having an event on April 15th called the Core Trials. To celebrate their launch, they're having four weekly tournaments and a total prize pool of $55,000. And you'll want to be quick because the first week is for $25,000 total and it's a shooter game. You know what that means. A lot of us watching my YouTube video play shooter games all the time and I know that. So guys, trust me when I say you could go win so much money right now. All you have to do is use the first link in the description. And if you end up playing in all four different games throughout the entire tournament, you get an Ashen Raptor mount, which looks really, really cool. Speaking of the first week of the tournament, though, we are going to be starting out with the actual games of it, which is Strike Team and Infinity Arena. Those are basically the two games you'll have to be playing to win a total of $25,000. So I guess let's get started. So here we are on Core. Obviously, I have a really cool outfit, so I can't thank Core enough. They ended up giving me a Founders Pack, which allows me exclusive access to really cool cosmetics. You guys can see I have my own wings. I also get a really cool horse. I have access to so many cool cosmetics. So if I hit Escape and go to My Collection, you guys will see I have loads of items. I have this guy right here. He's like a king of some sort. I've got a goblin. If I really wanted to be a goblin, I could. I could be like a spiky chain I think that's a girl actually too. That's pretty cool. But I think my two favorites are this guy right here called Radiant Trooper. And then I also like Radiant Zack. And those are just the characters. Let me show you my mounts real quick. So if I go to my mounts page, you guys will see I have a gold horse. I have a tank. I have a raptor right here. I have a wolf, a skateboard that floats in the air. Basically the same as this, but it's glowing. I have another wolf. Wow, they give you a lot of wolves. And then another horse. Anyway, the first game we're going to be playing is Strike Team. It's right over here. And did I mention you can fly? But we're going to use my horse. I love my horse. Let's go ahead and play some Strike Team. Okay, so here we go. We already have an enemy right there. Oh, well, he's quick. Let's go ahead and get him. Is he going to be right over here? Come on, buddy. Come back here. So basically, the point of this game is you have to go capture the flag and protect it if you are on it. And oh, there's already two enemies here. We can't let this happen. Okay, one's dead. Let me hide. Reloading. Let's go back out. Oh, wait. We're going to get the flag. There's no way they beat us here, right? And there we go. We got the strike point captured. So for the most part, you join in between games. Right now, it is three flags to zero. And we got him. Who else wants some of this? I know they're scared. I know they are. Oh, oh that's my teammate. I thought that was an enemy for a second. Man. And we're already getting the next point. That is how you play strike team. Oh, he's way over there. And you're dead. I am getting really good at this game, guys. Oh, wait. We can't let that happen. Wait, how'd I die? I, I, okay, cool. So let's just respawn and get this flag as quick as we can. Here it is. Let's go ahead and, uh, we already got two guys here. I'm oh. not letting them get to the flag. And we got both of them. Nice. I think we've got it now. I mean, we have three people sitting here at the flag with it almost captured. We should be fine and good. To yep. There we go. Uh, last point we need is right over here. Wait, is there a guy here? There is! Nope, you're dead. Sorry, it had to be done. I, I'm not like one of those guys who loves sitting on the point. I like protecting my boys who are on the point. And I think I do a pretty good job at that. So, oh. Come on, I hit you so low. He's gonna be right here. What? He's camping in a corner. What are you doing, buddy? And there we go. We ended up winning our game of strike team. Wow. Okay, here I am. I had 10 kills, one death. I think I did way better than everyone else. Like, this guy had 11 kills, but 15 deaths. That's pretty bad. And there we go. We're on our way to get a chest. We only would need to play one more game to get that chest, but we don't have time. I have a lot of games I want to cover in this video, so the next game we're playing is Infinity Arena. If you guys want to search for what game you're playing, there's a search bar right here under the play tab, and you can kind of just type in Infinity Arena arena and then the game should come up right here wow okay and this is actually a very new game it was published april 6th and it's been updated april 10th which right now for me it's april 13th so it's been officially one week since this game came out and it already looks like it has a lot of players okay and it looks like there's already a bunch of people in here and it's an open world game so let's go ahead and drive over here and start fighting some people 
Oh my gosh, this reminds me of Halo, guys. I think that's what they were going for, so I might sound kind of dumb, but just pointing that out. There we go. My aim's too good, guys. I don't think they're going to stand a chance here. What? What was that? <laughs> Yo, I got some green stuff around me. I guess that's what happens when you get a kill. There we go. One more shot and he's dead, I think. There we go. And man, I, I, I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm doing good. Oh, that's really cool. There's like a broken down tank right here. Uh-oh, wait, the, the ATV or whatever is stuck in it, though. I'm going to try and save it. Please don't kill me. Okay, I, I guess it's impossible. You can't get it out of there. Oh, no. Whee! I'm just going to reload real quick just so I'm ready. I was kind of just taking some <laughs> random... Wait, what is he doing? You can't damage him when he's on there? That's so dumb. Wait, he could try and run me over? Okay, I killed him, but what the heck was that? Oh, that guy just got the kill. I'm gonna try and hit him. Guys, it's super difficult sometimes, especially like when you jump and then... Okay, come on. Oh, he's gonna go try and kill him. I need to kill this guy before he gets it. There we go. That's how you do it. Oh, but he did end up getting one of the kills. Let's use our ATV to get... Oh! Oh! What gun is that? How do you get a better gun? What? He's invisible! Yo! Yo, he's got superpowers! I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. Guys, I, I, I don't know what happened right there. That dude was literally invisible. It's okay, though. I got my secondary out now. We are ready to take him out if he gets anywhere near us. Even though he's invisible, I'll know exactly where he is. Oh, this guy's dead. What? How do you heal that fast? Okay, we're, we're chilling. What? Yo! <laughs> oh my god, that scared me. I didn't even get to kill him. So the green stuff is it heals you every time that green thing goes off around you. That's it healing you. But right now it's five to three. We need to win this. The crosshair I would say is a tiny bit weird because I mean you're aiming into like a circle, right? Instead of like a dot. So you kind of have to guess sometimes where you're shooting inside of that circle. Because again, the players this far away can be slimmer than this circle. That's it, you're going down! I wonder if he could actually run me over if I'm just afraid of nothing. I just exploded his car. I'm so sorry, dude. It had to be done. It really had to, and you're dead. Yo, we might actually kill the invisible guy here. We need to help out this guy before he dies. <gasps> okay, I got the kill, and there's a guy here too. I don't think he realizes I, I was helping him. I thought it was uh, funny at first, but like he might actually kill me doing this. I killed him off of that explosion, man. Oh, right there. That's the invisible guy. I just dinked him, dinked him again. Dinked him. Dude, like, he's gonna die while invisible. Did I kill him? No, he's still here. Yo, he's got a rocket launcher. And there we go. Victory is mine. That's what happens. You can't go invisible and expect to win against the FPS master. 10 kills, 2 deaths. But now it's time to move on to my next, one of my personal favorite games, Arsenal of Guns. And here we are. So this is one of my personal favorites. Basically, you just run around an open map and you fight people. Okay, guys. So here we are on Arsenal of Guns. I didn't want to do it with just one player. So I invited some friends from my Discord and we are going to get into it. So here we go. And oh my, they're already getting a ton of kills. We have to be quicker. We have to be fast. Got one. Yo, what the? Oh, he's low. There we go. That is how you do it. So we're at three kills. <gasps> Yo, I, I thought I just killed him. There we go. We're chilling. There we go. Come on. Oh, is this a... Oh, I thought that was a sniper for a second. I was about to go off. Let's kill up. Oh, I did not get the kill. There we go. We're doing pretty good so far. We're at the top of the leaderboard. Oh, no. This gun has, like, no scope, so I'm kind of just blindly aiming. There we go. Oh! There we go. We're chilling. Okay, we traded right there. I am insane, guys. I'm so good at this game. Oh, he's hit for 20. I'm sorry, but... What? What? Wait, wait, wait. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, I'm not this bad. And I'm blinded by his light. There we go. No, he's one shot. I better not die. I really better not die. Where is he? He's down here. 
No, he stole my kill. You really stole it. Wow. And wait, he's coming back. Okay, so I think to win, you have to hit 20 kills in this game. I have 11. Uh, our, now Weasel is 11. There we go. We killed Weasel right there. There we go. And we're just missing every shot. But there's a guy here. There we go. Cool. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, Weasel. It had to be done. That had to be done. Whoa, whoa. I really should have killed him right there. Okay, there we go. I was like, there's no way I'm missing all these shots. Okay, okay, he's at 45. That's not bad. Oh, wait, what was that? What, what, what the heck is this gun? It's like a rocket launcher. Okay, th that's a little weird. Did not expect that. Uh, oh, 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 oh. This guy's just sitting there. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, I actually have to throw a knife to get the final kill. Oh! That was an insane knife! Get knifed. Haha. <laughs> oh man, I actually knifed him in the face. Okay, since I technically won Arsenal of Guns really fast right there, I'm gonna give him another chance at winning in Core Royale. I'm not gonna give him any prize or anything, this is just for bragging rights, and it looks like all four of us are in the lobby, so let's just wait. Yo, let's emote with this guy. What's up, Doom Shop? How you doing? Oh, why cry? Why you crying, yo? You should be dancing like me. I don't have that. Oh, he doesn't have that emo. Oh, well, rip to you. I'm sorry. It came with the founder pack. I think I'm gonna drop over here at this wooden area right here. This will be the perfect landing spot. Uh-oh, the bunny is dropping right next to me. I have to kill this bunny now, and we were so nice to each other in the lobby. Oh, I could have landed in that window, but I guess down here is fine. Maybe there'll be a crate really close by. There's a crate right there. Please don't tell me he drops down and insta-kills me. Okay, I have a pistol. He said, wait. I said, what? Where'd he go? He says he doesn't have a weapon. That's just more of a reason for me to go after him then, right? I think I was too nice to him letting him go like that. Because now he could just get a weapon and kill me. Okay, I have to kill him. There's no way I allow this. I'm sorry. It has to be done. Wait, lava just died. So it's me versus the light fire. So if I tab out, we need to move into zone, which is right over here. Before the zone reaches us, which it's actually really close, so we gotta be careful. Oh, and some ammo right here. And it was medium, which is what we need for this gun. Oh, there's a good crate. Oh, there's another crate. This is where all the loot's hidden. Nice. This is real good. I didn't know there was so much loot down. Oh, epic shotgun. Okay, we're chilling now. We got this in the bag. Oh, and I got bandages, so if I do get hit, I can heal up. I'm looking around for this last guy. I would have assumed he dropped over by the bridge, right? Like, towards that area. Another rusty assault rifle, but at least I got light ammo for my SMG. Oh my god, it's so purple. Oh, that's beautiful. I hear all this music over here. Where is he? I heard a shot. <gasps> I see him. He's got a sniper, so I can't peek this. This isn't good, guys. And I have to move into zone clear as day in front of- Wait, I see him. Okay, I might be able to hide in a bush before he- no, my wings! My wings! <laughs> Wait, my wings are gonna give me away. No! Yo, he's got a whole mount! Oh, I forgot you could use your mount! No, 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 no. Yo, he's right there! Yo, yo! Yo, get away, get away, get away! Get away, get away, get away! No, no! Okay. Wait, we're gonna hide right here? Oh! Okay, I hit him 15! Oh, we won! Let's go, dude! <laughs> I forgot you could use a mount in the game. I was so confused. I'm like, he's traveling really fast, but that was a solid game, guys. So although I usually play shooter games, the last game I want to show you guys is called Farmer's Market, which is actually a really cool experience in my opinion. And here we are in Farmer's Market, and you guys can see I'm growing my own pumpkins. So basically, you can run your own farm. You can go fishing, you can go metal detecting, you can upgrade your farm. You can do all sorts of stuff in this game, which is why this is actually becoming one of my personal favorite experiences out of everything on core. Of course, I can use my mount and everything, and this game is always populated with a bunch of people. Except Farmer Tracy just left the market. Rip the Farmer Tracy. So if I wanted to, I could pull out my metal detector, and we could search for some treasure. I hear it beeping a lot. Here we go. We're getting some treasure, and what is it? It's an old pitchfork. Okay. I mean, that's not bad. That'll be some money. And then I want to show you guys some fishing too. Although I can't show you guys me farming and all that because I have 
pumpkins still growing. I can show you guys some fishing if we find a fish anywhere. A fish is circling the lure, don't move. So you let it circle your lure and then you have to time it right. And boom, success. We got our uh, Corydoras catfish and we'll add it to our backpack. And then you can go sell it uh, in the middle of the entire map. So you go back to the market. This is where you can sell some of your crops over here. So let's see if I have any crops to sell. I have a carrot, which is $200, some tomatoes, which is $15 each, and then a strawberries. So we get $264 for that, where I can make some upgrades. And let's see the fish, 100 bucks. So we got 100 bucks for that fish. Oh, and then I claimed my daily reward of uh, watermelon. So you guys can see, I've played this four days in a row now, and I've got tons of stuff. So let's sell those. That was a free $1,200. Wow. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you, uh, game. But overall, if you don't want to play any of the shooter games I showed you today, this is the game to play. It's one of the best developed games I've seen on core ever. And overall, it's just a really fun experience, and it's pretty addicting, so I definitely recommend it. Oh, and I guess I can speed up since I have some of this um, speed grow. We can go ahead and farm some pumpkins and sell those as well to get an upgrade. So it costs $100 to plant a pumpkin. Let's see how much money uh, they're giving out today for each pumpkin you sell. Because it should be around $300 to $500, I believe, but we'll see. Whoa, $600! Wow, that's a lot of money. $1,800, we are doing that. Even though the price drop, I've seen it down to like $300 before, and it was awful. So, that's some good money to have. But yeah, and this guy's just following me. What's up, bro? What What's going on? How you doing? And that's mainly core. The last thing I could show you guys is if you go back to your collection, and you put on a skateboard like this one... You can actually do some, it's kind of like parkour, but it's more like a skate park in the lobby, and it's actually so much fun. So it starts over here, I believe, and you can actually go here, like look at this, boom, and you're in like these tubes doing some insane parkour, and it's so cool. Uh-oh, we almost failed that, nice. There we go, and then boom, can we make the jump? Oh, I made it, that was so close, that, that could have ended horribly. <laughs> that actually would have ended horribly if I missed it by a second. But yeah, that's Core. I had so much fun playing Core, and thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Once again, if you want to play any of the experiences in this video, click the first link in the description to download Core today. And remember, it's on Epic Games, so make sure you have your Epic Games account linked, and you will get some exclusive rewards. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.